this is Jamie Waters. Today I'm going to show you a process video of October scrapbook kit um, Wink Wink. So I wanted to do a fall layout and I decided I wanted to keep this extra bag portion as a photo mat. I love the craft and I liked the little crinkle at the edge. So I'm just cutting that out to kind of give me a guideline for my frame. I'm also going to use this transparency that came in the Wink Wink Planner Kit. I just like the black and white and the different months. Now this is a piece of paper from the main scrapbook kit and I love that little dot. So I'm just going to use a tiny bit as a corner. You can see it's all coming into shape there. The little arrows are part of the LOL embellishment kit. So what I really wanted to show you were these Wink Wink Fall stamps. They're part of the BRB embellishment kit, and when I first got them, I was kind of stumped. But after talking to some girls on the message board, <laughs> we realized you put the little shapes together, and the easiest one I came up with was this little octagon. So I stamped a bunch of them beforehand. And because I'm not a perfect stamper, I used little messy black lines to kind of trace it so that you couldn't really see my imperfections as well. And it just looks like part of the design. So I stuck to some fall colors. I did taupe and navy, a mustard and an orange. My stamp pads are really dirty because I used to let my kids play with them when they were little, but they still work. So I'm just going to cut out all these little shapes and I wasn't exactly sure what I was going to do with them but as I cut them out they all started to form this cute little line down the left hand side of the page. I thought maybe little groupings and then pulling some other embellishments from the other kits. These little circles, cameras, have been dying to use. So now here I just kind of place things around. This was actually a frame that was in the LOL kit, and I just chose to cut off part of it as a layer piece. Same with this orange. And now I think I've got a pretty good idea. I'm going to start sticking things down. And then for some dimension, I thought I would adhere some of the hexagon octagons. Are those hexagons or octagons? I don't know. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> and some of them on pop dots. So it took the three shapes to make that. The little diamond, the stripe, and the text. I'm sure you can get really creative and turn those shapes into other things too. And if you do, I'd love to see. <laughs> so the messy little drawings on the sides of those shapes, I think just help me feel like covers up any imperfections that I made. <laughs> and now I'm gonna put my little mat frame together. Over the years, I found that some of my embellishments have popped off my pages, so I'm really big on stapling things down now. That's just a little Polaroid. My daughter was a really little there. Unfortunately, we don't have a ton of fall colors here in Southern California, so I went with that one. It was actually a very vibrant yellow tree. Doesn't really look like that in the picture, but it was. And stick it all down. This is my favorite part, just seeing it all come together. And I don't always stick everything down all the way because I always find that I like to add little bits here and there, and that way I don't have to always be peeling all the way off and ripping papers. And so especially this little arrow needs definitely to be stapled down. 
And then now we can tape. So there's some other shapes that were on that Wink Wink Fall set, just adding to the little clusters. And then this is actually a gratitude uh, statement that's in the planner kit. The Hello Fall. And then I just hand cut those out of the paper that was in the LOL kit. I was going to say great for, for fall, and I only had one L here. And of course, I cut my T to become another L. Just add some hand journaling. And a few more little tiny heart stickers from the planner kit. Adding little details, pops of color. I added that pink E too by the heart. And that's it. Thanks so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed watching.